a glimpse into the grandeur, the portrait of Joseph de Jordines Why Nebert in the realm of art. Few pieces encapsulate the essence of their subjects as profoundly as Gilbert Stuart's 1794 masterpiece portraying Joseph de Jordines Why Nebert. Born in Valencia, Spain, Jordines was a figure of prominence, having arrived in New York City in 1785 and ascending the ranks to serve as the Spanish Chargé d'Affaires. The painting is a testament to Stuart's adeptness at capturing not just the physical likeness, but also the soul and stature of his subjects. In this piece, Jordines is depicted with an air of regality and authority that befits his status. The meticulous detailing in his attire underscores the prosperity of the Spanish Empire, during its zenith in territorial expanse across the Americas. Jordines' richly adorned attire speaks volumes, every stitch and fold is a narrative weaving through Spain's global influence and power. The red and black ensemble adorned with intricate designs exemplifies European grand manor portraiture's opulence, a style Stuart had mastered following his return from Ireland. The backdrop is equally telling, it serves not just as a spatial context, but also narrates an era where diplomacy was an art form, conducted amidst grandeur settings reflective of national pride and identity. Every element within this portrait, from Jordine's poised demeanor to his elaborate attire, he echoes an epoch where politics, power, and artistry were intrinsically intertwined. Following his marriage to Matilda Stoughton in 1794, this portrait stands as a commemorative piece marking their union, a fusion not just of two souls but symbolic of international alliances forged amidst political landscapes. As we delve into this masterpiece by Gilbert Stuart, we are transported into an era marked by imperial grandiosity yet grounded by human narratives such as that of Joseph de Jordines Y. Nebert, a man who embodied diplomatic grace amidst historical tumults.